Cops Harbour. Um, we're away for a three night trip right before Christmas. So we got myself and Kai in the Navara. We got my dad in his MUX. We got Chad and his son Ryan in their Land Cruise. And then we got a few other boys, local boys, joining us for the drive this afternoon. So it's coming out for an afternoon drive and I'll just the other three vehicles. Um, so what I'm doing this weekend is I'm following Tyler around and giving you guys an insight in uh, what he does to make one of his videos and all the work that's involved. Um, so um, I'll do the best I can and chase him around because um, as you're going to see he does a lot of um, running around up and down hills and um, be a good insight into um, seeing what's involved and what it, what it what he goes through to make a video. So um, hope you guys enjoy it. We've pulled up to this hill climb um, just off the the road there. There's the cars. But um Tyler's been up once. He's come back, grabbed the camera, and now he's gone up the south again. And then he's back down. I've only been up once and I'm puffed. But um yeah, track doesn't look too bad. Yeah, he's all right at this stage. Yeah, you're all right. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Can you straighten? Uh, can you straighten up a bit? Nice and slow. Yep. Keep going. You can turn a bit now. Yep. Uh, maybe diff lock now. Little bit of momentum from there.
It's yeah. his rear, his, it's his rear leaf springs burying him. You're getting hung up on your rear leaf. Tell him it's not hurting anything. Like, he probably needs to hold a slight bit more momentum. Just a bit more momentum, it's not going to break anything. Maybe come back a foot. Straight there. Did you want him straight or that way a bit more? He just asked if Malachi is alright. What's that? He just asked if Malachi is alright. Oh, yeah, he's good. He's good? What do you think, boys? Anyone earn a beer today? Oh, man. Yeah? Oh, I need a beer. I'm gonna grab one straight out of the fridge, I reckon. Yeah? Tyler downloads his footage from all the cameras every day, including the drone. He also then backs up this footage. All of this is done on a laptop with portable hard drives. Yeah. 
With the drone, I think it's all about smoothness. Like a lot of, like you don't have to keep everything center, center all the time. Yeah. I, I see a lot of people try and keep everything center, and they do slight adjustments. And I reckon those slight adjustments just like make it look terrible. Yeah. So you just keep, it doesn't matter if everything's center or not center. You just keep it smooth. Do you find to you fly a little bit slower to make it smoother and then you could speed it up when you're editing? Is that no, what you do? I don't, ever, I don't ever speed it up in editing. No. I find the sped up drone footage doesn't look good. I just like, I sometimes hold the controls not at max. So oh, I yeah. don't speed it up. Yeah. Edit. Should have cleared that whole thing. Yeah, well, yeah. The drone shots that I find look good is if you, so like if you're panning side to side and then you get a little bit of movement as movement well. Movement as well. Yeah. So you've got two, two axes of movement. Yeah. And you just try and hold it as steady as you can and then you can cut out the bits where you waver or like where you glitch out when you're editing. You can still hear it over the cicadas just so. Yeah. <laughs> Are they getting any quieter or? No. Nah. Nah. You know that if you turn it over it cuts it off. No, I didn't know that. Me running around all day. Yeah. Boots on, boots off. Yeah. That's the problem with water, you can't wear shoes. something a bit different. For the full episode of this Coffs Harbour adventure, be sure to subscribe to Tyler's channel and also mine. There are some great actions to come.